Are you sick of the Sunday scary setting in as you stare down the long work week ahead? So were the vast majority of the 61 UK companies that participated in the world's largest four-day work week test run last year. More than half have made the four-day trial permanent in the workplace. If you give people uh, this incredible incentive of a whole day of your time a week, they're going to work really hard to become more productive. It was this thought that drove last year's four-day week pilot trial that companies across the UK participated in. Now, one year later, a look back at the program is giving us insight into whether it'll work long term. According to a newly released report by the think tank Autonomy, of the 61 companies that took part in the trial, 89% of them have continued the four-day workweek policy, and 51% have made it official, permanently switching from five-day weeks to four. Shortly after the trial ended last year, Simon Ursell, the managing director at one of the firms, told the BBC that while the four-day week is great for employees' work-life balance, it's also been great for productivity. He says staff are taking 65% fewer sick days, and they haven't seen a drop in revenue. And we've seen our fatigue come down through the trial. So we can prove that our team are happier, less tired, and are making more money. Twelve months later, Ursel's initial findings have staying power. That's according to the Autonomy Reports author, Boston College sociology professor, Juliet Shore. I've been studying work since the 1980s, and I've never seen anything like what's happening today. Shore's findings showed real and long-lasting positive effects. 96% of staff who participated in the trial reported their personal life benefited from the shortened week, and 86% say they are more productive. The majority of the companies that took part, 82%, reported positive effects of the policy, and one-third saw a noticeable uptick in recruiting, with half reporting better staff retention. While Shore and other researchers contend that four-day work weeks help companies combat high turnover rates exacerbated by the pandemic, not everyone agrees that a four-day work week is the answer. The director at the Confederation of British Industries says the policy is not one-size-fits-all and argues not all industries can afford such a policy. Meanwhile, this month, the Scottish government has implemented its own four-day work week test run for some of its public services.